Alright guys, I got a whole new VR setup here, my HTC Vive, that's been featured in one of my videos so far, and now I got this new steering wheel setup with the chair, and uh, pretty excited, pulled up my old steering wheel. I'm going to try to play some Seto Corsa in VR, because it's probably one of the better games I could get for VR that wasn't overly expensive, because it's within my budget, just to kind of get a feel for VR racing, and maybe get an idea if I want to get into it for a little Nice. All right, we're all set up. Move the nerve ring now. Move the trusty RX-7. It's a very good rotary-driven car. One of my favorite Japanese sports cars in the 90s and in the late 80s. I love this car. So we'll see how it goes. I always wanted to drive one of these on the nerve ring and. You know, I've played the Nürburgring many times with the RX-7 before, but this is the first time playing the Nürburgring VR at all. So this is going to be pretty bomb. So here we go. Alright. My homemade gear shifter sometimes doesn't uh, comply. Likes to bounce me out of the gear I'm in. Not very competitive, but the other one broke, so it was just kind of what I had to do. It's funny how I'm trying to like casually talk. The Florian. Oh, oh my god. No. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. Ah. Jeez, that corner. The corner gets me. Every time, but it's harder to tell when I can't even see over the hill being a VR now. Oh my god. This is like actually mildly terrifying. experience with road racing games is Gran Turismo and a little bit of Forza. But I have no idea how I'll fare. Playing something that's supposed to be more of a simulator. I guess Gran Turismo is a simulator. actually feel how fast I'm going using the VR. I guess actually feel is probably the wrong way to explain it. But I get a sense of the speed. More of a understanding because my perception has changed. Also, I have very little experience with a set of Corsa. I did a little bit with the AEH6 going up the, the hill climb track there. Just because I wanted to try playing in VR. Blew my mind. That is an exciting experience. And absolutely terrifying. This is a little bit more tame because I know the track I guess when I was playing up that hill climb I have no idea where I'm headed remember this section at all. Oh my god. Whoa, that's steep. Whoa, oh my god. Oh my 
god. This is crazy. What? I'm passing my speedometer. I'm passing my 100, oh, 200 kilometers an hour. Oh my god. Oh my god. Definitely an experience I would love to have in real life. Uh, oh. Oh god. Oh no. Uh, oh. Alright. We're okay. get terrified when I almost crash or crash. It's insane. I'm trying to remember this course. It's been probably a year since I've driven it last on a on my PlayStation. It's hard to commentate and drive at the same time and drive fast. Oh god. There we go. Sorry, the controller dropped me out of gears there. Well, that could have been worse. Took me quite a while to not get motion sick while playing VR racing games. It's just crazy, it's a whole other perspective. But you don't want to actually move. I think you're moving. Uh... Oh, my God. Oh no, oh! Well, wreck one. I wrecked the car once. Oh man. Oh! Going off course doesn't count. As a wreck. If I hit a wall, we'll count it as a wreck. Take me out of the race. I don't. I don't remember the 
this section very well. Oh. Oh, this is that, that corner on YouTube. <laughs> some crazy videos about that corner on YouTube too. Turn was I just, just trying straight oh god oh here we go no oh, man I'm bouncing off the red line like it like an idiot missing my shifts because I'm so focused oh man I'm also oh oh wreck two yeah there's there's wreck number two all right. Two wrecks on a wreck counter here. Oh, it's the back stretch. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. 235, 240, 245, 47. 250, 251. Uh, this, is, this is crazy. 250 kilometers an hour. Here we go. Coming to complete one lap. What I get? Eleven thirty-seven. That is a terrible lap time. Eleven thirty-seven. Oh my god. Victory Donuts. So here we are, the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more of my content. See you in the next video.